Hey guys, Ben Tate here for CG Tuts, and in this tutorial we're going to be creating the iPhone 4S. Uh, I know it's a little late with the 5 coming out pretty soon, but we'll be tackling the 4S in this tutorial. Uh, I'm going to be using 3 Studio Max 2012 for this, although you should be able to follow along in you know pretty much any recent version of Max for the last couple of years. And you could probably even follow along in Maya, as long as you can translate Max's tools over to Maya's tool set. Uh, you shouldn't have any problems following along. Okay, the entire phone will be built using you know basic poly modeling techniques. Uh, it doesn't have a super high amount of detail, but we'll be trying to pack in as much uh, detail as we possibly can. All right, so we're gonna model everything, uh, yeah, everything even down to the anti dust mesh that's in these uh, speaker ports at the bottom. Okay, as well as obviously we have you know a couple of cameras, flash, uh, USB port there, and uh, quite a few holes for these buttons and uh, ports. All right, so we look at uh, a different couple different ways to cut in holes, a couple of different ways to terminate edges, and uh, obviously how to you know support your geometry so that it can uh, stay crisp and sharp when you you know later on apply turbo smooth or you know subdivision all right and then pretty much this entire model has uh, turbo smooth applied to it okay so we'll look at some techniques on you know how to maintain hard edges uh, around ports and holes with no artifacting and we'll also you know set up some blueprints and uh, use those as a basic guide to block out the proportions and shape before we start adding the detail Okay, it will be a multi-part project, and in later parts we'll do some, you know, textures, materials, and uh, probably render it out using V-Ray. But for right now, let's take care of the model, so let's jump into Max and get started. 